That switch on. Is it on? Guys, calm down. We'll give you enough time to, to, to get circled. Don't worry. Okay. Thanks for the Yes. Yeah, we're ready. ready. Yeah. Okay, the president's lawyer is going to give uh, a statement regarding the process. Uh, Advocate Popo. Yeah, thank you. Uh, the application has been launched. Uh, as you can see, it is a thick application. It's okay, it's okay, I'll start all over again. Yeah. Yeah. It's all right, it's all right. It's all right. Okay, the application has been lodged. Uh, as you can see, it is a thick application. Apart from this application, there's also a separate bundle of evidence which deals with all the issues that are raised in this application. Uh, so that process has not been done. Um, yeah, I guess that is all that they used to say. What are you seeking? What, what's the order that you're seeking? We are seeking a declaration to the effects that the presidential election was not properly conducted. It was not conducted in terms of the constitution. It was not conducted in terms of the electoral act. It was not conducted in terms of standards uh, of fairness, uh, transparency and accountability. Uh, consequently, we also seek a declaration to the effect uh, that the announcement made by uh, Justice Chikumba uh, declaring uh, Comrade Emerson Dambozum Nangagwa is the duly elected president of Zimbabwe. Uh, is faulty at law. Uh, it is null and void uh, and must be set aside. And on the basis of the evidence uh, that is that we've placed before the court, we seek in the main relief to the effect that the court must declare uh, the proper winner. And that proper winner is my client. In the alternative, we seek uh, that there be another uh, election uh, which complies with the dictates of the law, which complies uh, with the letter and spirit of the Constitution of Zimbabwe. Can you walk us through what happens next from here? What What is the process? What happens, what happens next, what happens next uh, is that the respondents, uh, if inclined, must now file their opposing papers. They must do so within three days. Um, but reckon from today, the matter must be heard with and determined within 14 days. Uh, and as regards the inauguration, there is no inauguration that's going to take place uh, up until the matter has been resolved by the, the court. That is the position. Who are the respondents? We wouldn't have come to court if we thought the courts would not give a fair, a fair judgment. Look, some of us are caught from animals. Some of us uh, have lived in court all our lives. Um, when, whenever we, we think that there is a case, we bring that case to court. Uh, the determination is something that is within the remit uh, of, of the court. So ultimately, what we can do uh, is to bring, as we have done, the application. Uh, everyone is going to go through the application. Everyone is going to follow through the arguments. Uh, and thereafter, the court will make its, its determination. It is for the court to make a determination. And it is for us to argue the matter. Who are the respondents? Uh, the respondents are uh, the parties to the election uh, and as well as the umpire uh, in its various constituencies. Are, are you ready for, for the wait that this, this case, um, over two million people are waiting on you to, 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 to dispense this matter with the technicality that it deserves? Are you ready for that? Yes, I, I, I have never before felt this kind of burden on my shoulders, but I have never been more ready. Uh, I, I am ready to defend uh, the 16 uh, million Zimbabweans. I am ready to defend those who voted for my for my client. I am ready to argue the matter and make no mistake about it. Is it true Are you not that concerned you with the parliamentary? Uh, votes, extra less, votes, le less, than than that. Less, less, than less than that. And so you found them? Can you tell us what the figure is? Yeah, you see, you see the figure in the in the application. But uh, but but there are so many things that you're going to see in the application. For instance, we've managed to place before the courts uh, unpopulated those signed V11 forms. And how does that happen? We've managed to place before the court uh, V11 forms, uh, which show an attempt to erase. The figures that had been that had been entered, we've managed to place before the court 
all the mathematical and stat statistical irregularities we've managed to place before the court uh, the background issues that bear on the conduct of a free, uh, fair, and credible election. Okay. So what what must now do is to argue the matter. So okay, guys, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. 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 Thank you,
mafiga esa ipo anaka e pane umbo uneo chekuita nema itu regime ya tukati process pachirungu e pane umbo we mamiru vekunze pangwa yesarudzo mapano box ajiunzi kwa akakomwa kare pano ajihlikidzigwa nokuroha pamwechete noku you know ga zvinhu zvakadaro izvo zvondombo wacho tanzwa mchete mwari kuchikisidzira eh vana vano ndifisidzira eh hava hava shikumira eh naiko zvino ndichiri kungo manya ndotogara musango eh pane zvinhu zvakatoitika pamuviri wangu nekuda kugara musango eh asi asi sutiri magweta ndora kuti mzee chinhu muna november eh i i defended operation restore legacy both in court and on national television. I defended it uh, on the basis uh, that was, in my view, sustainable at law. And after I defended that operation, nobody came to me and said, Savan, you've become a politician because you've defended Operation Restore Legacy. Now, this, those same people, now that I'm res defending Chamisa, I've turned around. And I'm now saying I've become a politician because I'm defending I'm defending Jamisa. The problem that I have with Zimbabweans is that they want to choose uh, who my clients are. And I will not let anyone do that. And when they try to threaten me, when they try to harass me, uh, they can only strengthen my resolve. I never want to back down. I've never backed down from any challenge and I will not do so. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, so they were Yeah, yeah, I will do, I will do that.